Um, today, let's work on uh, kangaroo math competition question. Right? This question is for uh, grade uh, for eleventh grade, um, so fairly fairly difficult. Now, we have uh, a diagram uh, that shows uh, this is a circle right here, and this line. Underneath it is a tangent. Right? O is the circle, um, and then the arc BP uh, has length 16. The arc AP has length 20. And the question wants to know uh, what is this angle here? What is the angle AXP? Right. So they are interested in this angle AXP. Um, so to to start, we we have to uh, recognize that uh, AB this length is obviously the diameter of the circle, and therefore uh, this OB is the radius, and also OP is also the radius. Um, now because this is the diameter, and therefore the sum of AP and BP together is uh, a half circle. And half circle, from this we can we can uh, calculate the the circumference for the so whole circle. It's it's simply uh, the sum of these two arc times two. Then you get the circumference. So the circumference is uh, the sum of these two r times 2, which is 20 plus 16. 20 plus 16 uh, times 2. And 36 times 2, which is 72. So 72 is the circumference, the entire circumference of the circle. The second step. Now, And um, we create an angle. We, we name this angle here. Uh, this angle is angle POX. Right? So let's find out this angle first. If after finding out this angle, it's easy enough to calculate this angle. That's because uh, XP is a tangent. So this is a right angle right here. And therefore, the sum of these two angles is 90 degree. So when when you know this uh, this angle to find angle x, what you do is 90 subtract this angle, and then you have the answer right here. All right. So how do we calculate this angle right here? Um, the the ratio of this angle, angle POX to 360 degree, which is the whole angle, is uh, the same as the ratio of the arc BP to the entire circumference, to the whole circumference. So, um, so we have this mathematical expression, arc BP over circumference is equal to angle POX, this is angle POX, over the whole angle, which is 360. Now, once we have this set up, uh, we can simply do some substitution. We substitute at BP, which is 16. The circumference we calculated uh, previously, uh, it was 72, right, in previous slide. So this becomes, this whole fraction becomes 16 over 72. 16 over 72. And this is equal to angle POX this angle POX over 360 degree, which is the whole angle. Um, you simplify this fraction, this becomes 2 over 9. All right, you, um, right, this becomes uh, 2 over 9. And then 2 over 9 equals uh, angle POX divided by 360 degree. And therefore, 
angle POX is um, 80 degree, right? So all you need to do is you multiply uh, both sides by 360, and then this becomes 80 degree. Um, and on the right hand side, obviously 360 will disappear after multiplying that by 360 degree. On the left, it becomes um, 80 degree. So you know now this is 80 degree. So to calculate this angle, all you need to do is angle AXP is equal to 90 degree minus 80, um, which is 10 degree. Now you know the sum of these two is 90 because BP is a tangent, so implicitly, um, this is a right angle here. And therefore, the sum of the other two is 90. And uh, E is the answer. Okay, uh, thank you very much for watching. Bye-bye.